in the heart of the night, all night long. Let the great tunes whisper sweet nothings in your ear. Join us and listen to some cool jazz on Nairobi's 98.1 Cool FM. Thanks for calling Cool Star Refrigeration Malindi. We are the number one dealers in home appliances such as refrigerators, washing machines, televisions, freezers, air conditioners, cookers, ovens and many more kitchen appliances. We are located opposite Malindi Tourist Market just before former old low courts. Visit us today for the best offers. Cool Star Refrigeration Malindi creates your home. La forêt est pleine de surprises. On peut y construire des cabanes, y trouver des trésors, rencontrer des animaux. Elle permet même de produire de l'énergie renouvelable. En France, la forêt est deux fois plus importante et quatre fois plus dense qu'au milieu du 19e siècle. Autrement dit, il y a 150 ans, il y avait deux fois moins d'espace pour se promener dans les bois. The following program contains questionable language that may not be appropriate for younger audiences. Viewer discretion is therefore advised. The following counties are on high alert for tornado warnings across southeastern United States. All school buses servicing elementary and secondary institutions in Middlesex and Elgin County have been cancelled due to deep snows. Please make alternate arrangements for students attending schools nearby. Keep our earth green and don't be a litter bug. This has been a message from the Environmental Legacy Foundation of Westerville Oaks. If 12 jumbo jets crashed every year, something would be done about it. Every year, nearly 6,000 teens die in automobile accidents. We can all help stop teen driving deaths. And the good news is, we can start today. It's time to make the world a safer place to drive. That's all states stand. All state, you are in good hands. My father was born in the last third of the 19th century, an era of great cultural, economic, and religious upheaval in Igbo land. His mother had died in her second childbirth, and his father, Achebe, a refugee from a bitter civil war, did not long survive his wife. And so my father was raised by his maternal uncle, Udo. It was this maternal uncle, as fate would have it, who received in his compound the first party of English clergy in his town. The new arrivals, missionaries of a new religion, Christianity, had already conquered the Yoruba heartland and were expanding their footprint in Igbo land and the rest of southern Nigeria with their potent, irresistible tonic of evangelism and dedication. 